Shadow, what do you think it's like on Earth? The professor said his life's work was dedicated to all of those who live down there. He once told that the reason for his existence was making people happy through the power of science. Shadow. Maria, I just don't know anything anymore. I often wonder why I was created, what my purpose is for being here. Maybe if I go down there, I, I will find the answers. Maybe. Maria. Why so melancholy? That was so unexpected. So unlike you, Shadow, to come and rescue me. But your ability to use the chaos control certainly comes in handy. You know, I didn't come to save you. I came back for the chaos emeralds. Yeah, yeah, but then again, that's not the whole story, is it? Everything is ready to go. Are you sure? We only have six of the seven Chaos Emeralds, you know. It's more than enough for the demonstration. So let's get the show on the road. <laughs> Citizens of Earth, lend me your ears and listen to me very carefully. My name is Dr. Eggman, the world's greatest scientist, and soon to be the world's greatest ruler. Now witness the beginning of the greatest empire of all time. <laughs> Why are you so upset? Well, that was really impressive. You've managed to create complete havoc on the whole planet. Does this now mean we control the planet and can do as we choose? At this rate, the cannon will take too much time to charge up. If you want to unleash its full potential, you'll need all seven Chaos Emeralds. Where in the world have you been? Something happened? Our threats fell on deaf ears. Look at you, throwing a tantrum like a little kid. How totally embarrassing. Don't forget your end of the bargain, fat girl. What about that last chaos emerald? We had a deal, right? So where is my emerald? Here you go. I found this. Why didn't you show me this before? This station square saved from a life-threatening missile attack. The city has awarded its famed prize to the boy who saved Station Square. Miles' tales per hour was given the Chaos Emerald as a testament of his heroic deed at a ceremony held at City Hall. <laughs> this makes things a whole lot easier. Hurry, go back to Earth and find them fast. I want that Chaos Emerald! Did you get that? Soon enough, Maria. This is Rouge reporting. Currently, I have not been able to confirm that Shadow is the ultimate life form or not. I will continue my research on Project Shadow and have a follow-up report very shortly. And just a reminder, don't forget about my jewels. All right, we're on Route 280. And, um... Box boy, wait for me! Um, everyone makes this joke, but, um, Rouge, the shape of your car is oddly phallic. That's all I'm going to say. Oh, jeez. So this, I think, is a little harder than, um, Route 101, which I think Tails is. But, um, I don't really need to talk about that. I just need to talk. I want to talk about the cutscene beforehand. 
the one where Eggman's doing the temper tantrum in the beginning. I love that cutscene. It's so, it's great. There's so many great things about that cutscene, right? Eggman throwing that temper tantrum is hilarious, first of all. Uh, also, you don't make this jump sometimes. There you go. Made it. Um, Eggman throwing that temper tantrum is hilarious. Uh, also, uh, the connection with Tails saving Station Square from a missile uh, is an awesome callback to SA-1. And I, I really like it a lot. It adds continuity. It's like consistent. It makes it feel like a whole universe. Like a cinematic universe. It'd be great to marvel at. Ha 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 ha. But also, um, also the, uh, I like how everyone is in such a panic that they're just like not paying attention to Eggman and they're like, we're all gonna die. And Eggman's like, well, if you listen to me, you ain't gonna die. Just do what I say. And they're like, we're gonna die. And he's, he's angry because no one's listening to it. It's great. I love this. I, I love the cutscenes in this game. Ugh, Eggman's so demanding, too. Like, like this Eggman compared to, like, whenever Eggman has to team up with Sonic in, like, the newer games. This Eggman's like, did you do it yet? <laughs> Just, like, give me time. Jesus Christ. He's so demanding. Alright, well, we're almost done. At least I'm pretty sure we are. You gotta be careful with these. I don't wanna... You don't wanna fall down into the pit. To the pit of doom. Can I make it? Can I make it? Ooh! Like I said before, sometimes you just can't make those. And it's, uh... It's upsetting, but, you know, it happens. Can't really change anything about it. Also, I love running into these cars, because they just go flying. Ooh! Unless, uh, you're doing mission four, I think it is? It's either four or three that you can't hit any of the cars. Which sucks in these areas. I think I talked about that in Tails mission though, how you can't hit the cars over the walls, like that's one of the missions, and it sucks. It's just, it's just straight up awful. Like, not fun. It took me forever to do, because I sat down and I did it one afternoon, I did both of them, and they both took me forever. Because you also have to, especially if you're trying to get the A ranking, uh, then it just, it just sucks extra. Because you gotta be fast about it too. How did I not do that without like going out of control? Okay, well, almost landed in the water, but you know what? We're on the home stretch here. We just need to. We'll find Tails. He'll, he'll just, you know, pop up into existence. Uh, oh, there he is. There he is. What's up, Tails? I think you're going. I you think you're going the wrong way, bud. I think you're going the wrong way. And look at him. He's so orange. He's just an orange Tails boy. Hey, we got an A rank. A, we got an A rank. Did not mean to do that. But you know what? Oh, I'm, I'm going with it. I'm going with it. It's live. It's recording. I can't change it. I can edit it. But, uh, you know, that's extra work for me. And wow, we can do kart racing for player two. Kart racing P2 versus now available. And then, yeah, we just jump into Skyrim. <laughs> Shadow, they're in that blue plane. Spotted at 11 o'clock. Copy that. I'm in pursuit. All right, well, this is Shadow's third level, and it was actually, Sonic is actually seen uh, playing this level in, I think it's a trailer. So that's why people think that Shadow was not supposed to be playable. Same with uh, Rouge and Tails. People, I think it's, um, I think it's not a common knowledge thing, but I think people um, didn't know that, or what am I trying to say? I think it's a thing that pe people speculate. That's what I'm trying to say. Oh, great. Um, this is amazing because you can go like this. Oh, well. It didn't, he didn't do it that time, but sometimes you just orbit around them. Just like real crazy. Like I think you have to not be holding the control stick forward. I think that's how you get it. But I really like Skyrail. I think Skyrail is one of my favorite levels. My, my, I think it's my favorite shadow level. Um, it's really... It just, it's fun. Except for that, when that happens. Oh, I hope I don't get shot again. Please don't shoot me. Please don't throw me in the trash. I don't know where that rail goes. I've never been ballsy enough to jump over there and see where it goes. It's just been a mystery to me. Can I make it? Yes, I can. Can I make it? Okay. Well, that was scary. That was that was big scary. Oh, I want the I want the rings in the life. I didn't have any ring, rings from when I lost it. Oops. That would have been bad if I would have got shot. 
You know, I've been... I, I, shouldn't, I shouldn't say this because it's not 100% true. But I've been... Get not see getting into is the wrong okay well this is dangerous because you can fall off these rails okay if you're not getting enough speed you can fall off the rails um uh what's what's the word that I'm looking for it's not okay okay there we go um it's not I've just been consuming a lot of Sonic 06 uh, me oh yeah you can't break these guys which is it's really weird because I think it's the only time they show up um I've been consuming a lot of Sonic 06 like media if that makes any sense I've just been watching a lot of Sonic 06 stuff and um this is going back to the shooting part one thing I really like about Sonic 06 I do I do like Sonic 06 uh, a little bit uh, one of the good things I like about Sonic 06 is that they have little cannons and they just take your rings down instead of just getting rid of all your rings right away. Doctor, they're heading directly toward us. What should we do? pretty rough we did it let's go amy yeah you little thieves did you really think eh? you could get out of here on come and get some eggman just leave it to me this time as well as the chaos emerald i call on you to destroy these pests come off my servant He doesn't have eyes. Tria! Hey, that's not what happened. Alright, well I completely forgot about this boss, uh, <laughs> but this is actually one of my favorite bosses uh, in this game just because it's so different, you know, you fight him as Sonic and then you have to go fight him as Eggman and not only are you fighting him in both stories, you're fighting them with different mechanics, you know, because you were fighting him as with a speed character at first and now you're fighting him with a, um, with a mech character and that's that's strange. It's really weird. And this boss, this boss is actually pretty easy. I, oh, I didn't mean to do that. No, I usually do it all in one because it's really fun to watch it all go down all at once. Um, but you just, yeah, you're supposed to break these open. And I mean, we already beat the boss essentially. Uh, I'm just really bad at my job. Uh, you just gotta break open the the inner workings of it, and then shoot the things. I like shooting them all at once because the meter just goes just plummets and it's 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 hilarious but yeah it's a it's a lot easier a lot easier <laughs> green light for launch primary engine ignition on beginning liftoff countdown 10 9 8 7 6 5 4 3 2 1 shuttle liftoff 